SAT prep, here we go. This is the Madagascar Steve. How many four-digit numbers can be formed using digits one through seven? No repeats, and it must be odd. Okay, so we have four digits, but since it must be odd, then we know the last digit must be a one, three, five, or seven. So there's only four options here, okay? And then we say, well, what's the uh, options for the rest of the digits, okay? So uh, we know, okay, once we've chosen, or once we have the fourth digit, then we only have six digits left, right? Now, let's say no repeats, right? So uh, if we choose for the first digit, say one of those six numbers, then there's six options, but once we choose that number, then there's only five options left, okay, guys? So five options must be here, but then once we choose the first and second digit, there's only four options left for that third digit, okay? So now we use our multiplication principle, which just says, well, we can multiply all these numbers to find out how many options that we have. And so we know, okay, six times five is 30, um, times four, which is 120, and then times four, we get 480 possibilities. Always remember, math is everywhere.